So, okay, where did action tank start? Oh yeah! Better than ever! Ready, go! Yeah, it's sort of a it's sort of a combination of things. Uh, I wanted I really wanted to make some sort of a physics-based platformer. Our artists they like to do uh, sort of colorful stuff, but also realistic. And that's how we came up with the toys. Basically, we came up with the idea. We started prototyping it, and we even we even showed it at some some events. And then we said, well, we have some time, we have some money. So we ha we basically had no clue what we were doing. We just sort of started working, and then we were like, okay, well, we'll just see where we end up. Uh, I modeled some stuff, so basically it was making toys. I already had a lot of toys and uh, it was harder for me to make a decision what to design because I had a huge list of what I wanted to make. So in the end, it was just a tiny part I could make. Uh, the biggest challenge for me was to put everything in just this confined space because you have this this really nice uh, space you want, but you want it for people to be interested everywhere you look at. Everything you want to see has to be like, oh, and this, oh, and this brings me back, and this takes me back today. So putting that all into one room, and so everywhere you look should be exciting. That's basically what was the, the main challenge, yeah. So when we were doing like initial design stuff, and we were just like trying to build these levels with blocks. And then the same goes for all the action figures. Like we, we, went, uh, we all went to our parents and we looked up all our old toys and like all the stuff we played with when we were younger. And we just all put it together. So that definitely sort of got us in the right mood when we were uh, starting and you know, making the game. I'm coming from a, an industrial design environment and there you always have uh, limitations. On the computer you, you have no boundaries and you can make a rocket if you want and you can even in the end let it fly. If I could design an island for my own, this is the island I want to make. So I have this, this beach where you can like relax and chill and like there's this huge boat which is like a huge party area and there's also this huge jungle with a lot of foliage in there so you can just relax. Basically like my own dream island. And we knew that was going to be really hard to do. We were like, okay, let's do six months and it will probably take a year to actually finish it. I guess in the end it took us one and a half years. I mean, making games always takes longer than you, than you expect. While we were launching, we were also contacted by, uh, by publisher Curve Digital to bring the game to consoles as well. And uh, yeah, their action eggs coming to console fairly, fairly soon. So I guess that's sort of the whole story. <laughs> Not just the start, it's that, so that's the story of action eggs.